Hello, my name is Ilona. Uh, I first like to respond again <laughs> to Mr. T announcing that everyone should get the wasp sting. I understand there's a lot of confusion. I have spoken about this many, many times. So I'm just going to say this once more. Uh, Mr. T needed to uh, put warp speed behind the wasp stings when he was still in office because otherwise the plan of the black hats would have they were they were able to pull off the plan they had in mind which means that we would be restricted for years everything would have been destroyed all um businesses or jobs would have been gone they would have restricted everything and then they would have come up with the wasp sting which would have been fully approved and then it would have been mandatory because mr t pushed it so much it's not uh, fully approved even though the fda i know there's been some news about that that's apparently it's fully approved it's not it's just extended the emergency approval. So it's not been fully approved. It's important to know. So the FDA did not fully approve it. It just extended the emergency approval. So in a way, they cannot make it mandatory. People need to understand that this is a war at a global scale. And they just think that, oh yeah, because Mr. T said this, well, he has to be a black hat then. And I'm like, how long have you been in this game now? Please understand that this is a war. This is not something that um, you really need to understand the scope of things. So he made sure that it couldn't become mandatory and it still cannot become mandatory, even though they are throwing that out, of course, in the media, of course, who are in control of the media, still in a way, the black hats. So look at it that way. Don't believe everything you see. And that Mr. T is still uh, telling people to get the wasp sting. He most likely is talking about something completely different. And this is, of course, not a message to us. People have a choice. That's a choice they need to make. So I even watched uh, someone, um, I put it on my uh, channel and uh, was very thorough. It was actually mentioning about the free will. This wasp sting has to do with uh, choosing for your soul connection or not. So this is very, very deep and people need to make that decision for themselves. Of course, Mr. T cannot make that decision. If people are just going to follow him, that's really on, on them. We need to stop just following people without doing our research. We really need to stop that. That's what we're here for, to really stop... Uh, having other people think for us, just like people are uh, asking me about this controlled opposition. Is this person controlled opposition or not? I'm not going to look at that. We are now in a, in, in a phase, we need to step up ourselves. We need to see what resonates with us or not. And we need to make decisions accordingly. So I just don't follow one person. I look at videos, I look at information and I see if it resonates with me or not. So if things come out in the media, I already look at it with a side eye because most of it is not true. It's manipulation. It's just fear mongering. We really need to step out of this. So if someone says something like Mr. T, feel, is there something else going on? Really, what does, does it resonate with me or not? And when I, he says things like that, I personally believe it really has to do with free will. People have to make their own choices in that. But he made sure it didn't become mandatory. At least we didn't follow the plan the Black Hats had in mind. He saved a lot of people. Just imagine that if we were stuck for like years on end in restrictions and then there would have been wasp sting, there would have been mandatory. You think of the losses. Just keep that in mind. So. I just want to take a look because I found um, something very interesting. First of all, I read that in Italy, the uh, emergency of the wasp sting hasn't been extended. So that's a bit strange. So in a way that kind of the entire basis for the wasp sting drops. So I'm not sure uh, if they're going to, is there, if they're going to make a new law for that or uh, how that's going to work out. In Denmark, 
uh, from the 1st of October, everything will be lifted. Everything, all restrictions will be gone. Another thing I read was from a Dr. Dominique Rueff, or at least I saw an article that said, and I couldn't find anything about that, but I'm just going to take a look at it with the cards, that the U uh, European Union has uh, approved five therapies for what's going on in the world. And if they do so, that's uh, at the 1st of October, which is interesting with Denmark, obviously. So if that's the 1st of October, then of course the entire wasp sting and the emergency use will, you know, fall away. Just like in Italy, that emergency law that has not been extended. So the basis for the wasp sting is pretty much gone. So um, in the article, it was mentioned that um, everything, the therapies will be put into practice from the 1st of October. And then from the 20th, I think, of October, everything with the wasp sting will be gone. Like I said, I couldn't find anything about that. So I'm just going to take a look at it with the cards because in a way it does resonate with me because that will explain why everything is being pushed now because they don't have a lot of time. If they have till October to get everyone um, a wasp sting, then I understand the urgency. So I'm just going to take a look at it. Like I said, I don't have like uh, proof of that, but this is something I, that came across. I put it on my channel and I just want to um, see if this information is correct or not. If it really, everything's going to fall away in October. This is the two of cups card above. This is the central card. That is the queen of pentacles. This is a yes, Ace of Cups. It's in the past, but it is a yes. This is the Eight of Swords. And this is the Magician. This is the Future card. So to me, like I said, this is a yes. So that's probably why they've been pushing it, like why they've put, been pushing it in countries, why they really need people to take it now because it is going to fall away in most likely October. Maybe even sooner. I don't know about that. That's my feeling. But October is what I'm looking at right now. And there's a new help, new way of looking at health. And the Queen of Pentacles. The pentacles are associated with Earth, with the body, with health. So this is the central card, the new way of looking at health. So the therapies will come out. And when the therapies come out, because it is an emergency wasp sting, because of Mr. T, who helped with that, it will drop because as soon it's an emergency because there were no other therapies. So as soon as there are other therapies for what's going on around the world, that will mean that the wasp sting will fall away. So, and this is the influence above. This is the two of cups. This is about healing about connecting again. The cups uh, is, of course, the element of water. So it's about connecting with people, um, really being in touch with health again. So I do believe that this information is correct. And I do believe that in October, things will fall through. So in, in a way, it will all things around the wasp sting will fall away. That's my feeling. All these restrictions will drop. So that's probably why they've been pushing it so far now. So uh, how do you say that? So much in the media. Things need to be done. That's why they come with those passes. That's why they really are pushing through and through and through to get as many people as possible uh, taking the wasp sting. So things are pretty much in October falling apart for the black hats and the agenda of the wasp sting. That is also probably why they're going more through a how do you say that towards the climate agenda, which is the next agenda in line. The magician, this is interesting. This is the future. The future is that this seems to me like returning the power to the people, pretty much. The magician is having everything uh, like the cup, the pentacle, the sword and, and the wands, the wand, everything in hand to manifest successfully and this this is really the card if you want to talk about your own authority about manifesting successfully and truly being 
faithful to yourself and loyal to what feels right to you, that's the magician. The magician also has the, the, the sign of the eternity, the soul connection. He, he is really in control of his own faith, of his own fate, so to speak, and his own faith. So he believes in his own faith and he follows his own faith. He follows his own path. This is about manifesting. This is about having everything in front of you and manifesting a completely new world. So in this, this is very positive in my mind. This is new future. So I have a feeling in October, a lot of things will change. That's probably after October. This is more of a future. So October, November, December, we really start manifesting the world we want. And we uh, gain control again of our health and our freedom and our own individuality and our own connection with our souls. It's really about taking back our power. So I uh, want to leave it at that. I hope to see you in another video. Bye.